So I spent the past three days building an in real life submarine so I could take on the hardest buildable challenge ever made. To build a submarine while in a submarine. Now before we get into things, I would like to advise nobody to try this out themselves. This was very dangerous and also very stupid, so please do not try this at home. All right, I'm officially playing Alright guys, time to build a submarine before the oxygen runs off. Yes, guys, you heard that correctly. I have to build this submarine before my oxygen runs out. As you can see, I have seven cans of air. Each one of these is rated for about 10 minutes of oxygen, which gives me a little over one hour to complete this entire build, or I will literally drown. So starting things off, I tried keeping a level head, you know, not get too stressed out about the idea that I only have an hour to complete this entire build. Oh my God, it's really bright out here, it's hard to see. But as I was trying to keep a level head, I ran into the most inconvenient build about troll I have ever run into. And all of a sudden, it became a little bit more difficult to keep my head on straight. And in that moment, I was very grateful for this little feature called isolation mode. But that's when I ran into my first very serious roadblock. All right, there goes the first guy. Number two, here we go. So I was supposed to get about 10 minutes of air out of every single can, but I was only able to get about six minutes before the first one ran out. And because of that, it cut my building time nearly in half. All right, so far this is turning out all right. Um, but all that I've done is built the easiest part of it all, so it doesn't really say all too much. <laughs> but then only four minutes after I finished the first can, I had to drop off the second one. Oh my God, okay. This was very bad. At this rate, I might only get 20 minutes of build time instead of the expected hour. But then I thought to myself, as long as I can finish smoothening up the entire circle before the next can runs out, I think I'll be okay. All right. Four left. I'm just not very used to building on the phone, so it's more difficult than I thought it would be. Now, I think this is a good time to tell you guys that I'm actually really, really bad at building on mobile. I have very fat thumbs and I can't click the buttons right. So this was a very difficult challenge. And on top of that, this was actually one of the first times I've ever done it. Oh my God, three hits left. Oh my God. Like I just said, there were three cans left, but to be completely honest with you, it was starting to become harder and harder to breathe in there because of some like science and physics and you know what, whatever. I just knew that I was starting to have a bit of a hard time getting the oxygen that I needed to keep going. So only 20 seconds later, I already grabbed my second to last can. But then only a couple seconds later, I was already off to the final stretch. I could no longer take it. Okay, guys, <laughs> we are off to the final can. This is the only thing. We're almost done though, I think we can do this. And those were my famous last words. I think I can do this. Well, guys, let me tell you, I couldn't do it. I failed the challenge, and sadly, I had to finish the build on the computer uh, later, dry, but I was no longer freezing my butt off. But who would have thought that that would have been exactly what I needed to make this build the perfect submarine to finish the challenge? So now that I can finally breathe again, let's check out what we built. Now, when I say that this was the most challenging build I have ever done, that is an understatement, guys. This was so difficult. At some point, I started getting really worried because it actually became incredibly hard to breathe. But let's hope that our build about submarine doesn't do the same thing to us. <laughs> Now, there's actually a couple things left over from the build itself. Because it was my first time working on mobile, I actually had a very hard time uh, doing all of the duping and stuff like that. I mean, look at how tiny this thing is. It's so hard to tap the buttons and, like, properly select the right block. So, yeah, uh, I actually built this thing uh, to help me a little bit while I was building. But, I mean, hey, the final design right here ended up a little bit goofy, but I quite like it. So, with that, it's about time we hop on. And when we sit down, we can start admiring some of the details I put into this thing while I was literally suffocating. Uh, 
um, I decided to add in a little propeller. <laughs> now that's pretty nice. And guys, leave it or not, I know this is gonna blow your mind. It actually works. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, yeah, guys. And uh, you know, other than that feature, I quite honestly didn't really have time to add anything else because, like I said, I was literally drowning. But honestly, I'm very happy with the design, and hopefully, it should also be sturdy enough to bring us all the way to the end. But you know what, guys? I honestly think it's safe to say that this is the first ever built that was created under the water. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know if this thing is going to make it all the way to the end. Most of it has been built using only plastic, which is the weakest material in the entire game. And as you guys can see, the ceiling is already cracking. So if we are very, very lucky with the stages that we got, we might be able to make it. But honestly, it's going to be difficult. It is going to be quite a challenge. I'm going to have to dodge as many of these rocks or whatever lily pads as I possibly can. At the moment that our top cabinet gets damaged too much, death is inevitable. <laughs> oh my God. What just happened? There are, oh, don't, oh God. Guys, any of the new stages is bad, bad news. These new stages do so much more damage than the old ones. Oh my God. The entire bottom half of the boat is gone. Oh crap. This is not good. Wait, at least, at least I don't think we have the electric stage. The electric stage is crazy overpowered. And actually a brand new one. If you haven't seen it yet, it wouldn't shock me. Oh God, please no explosion. If we hit a single explosion, this can go very, very bad. Come on, dodge, 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 dodge. Ah! Oh my God, dude, there's explosions actually dropping down from the ceiling. Oh my God. Oh my god! Ah, we just got into the head. Wait, please don't tell me. Please don't tell me. Oh my God, no. Oh my God, this is bad. This is bad news. Bad news, boys. The most damaging stage of the game. Wait, if we get past this, we will actually make it. Come on, as long as we can get through this crack right here. It's so thin though. Come on. We need some really good steering right here. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Okay, wait. <gasps> I see a path. I see a path right there through the hole. Okay, we gotta just thread the needle here. Come on, guys. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 we got stuck. Oh God, no. Yes, we made it. Oh. Oh my god! Wait, oh, we still have the spikes. We still have the spikes! Come on! Ah! Please don't hit me! As long as it doesn't hit me, I should be okay. Come on, please! Oh my god. I don't know how it's possible, but we somehow managed to get stuck on this tiny block right there. If that block was gone right there, and that one, that could have been a totally different story. Oh my god. I can't believe that we just managed to reach the end with the first ever underwater, underwater build. Now, if you guys have any idea for a future building challenge, please leave a comment down below. I already have some insane plans in the works like building a roller coaster on a roller coaster building a rocket in space and building a horse while riding a horse truly guys you guys can come up with the craziest stuff and if i can manage to do it i will and also guys i just want to stress this one more time please do not try what i did in this video yourself this was very stupid i actually started getting very lightheaded there at the end and apparently that's like hypoxia or i don't know what it is but it was not a very smart idea so please do not try it at home uh, just watch this video five more times if you want to experience it yourself there you go <laughs>